If you were to look here, you'll see this black staining on the stem here. This is a really typical symptom of something called acute oak decline. And that is a, a vast threat to our oak trees in this country. Here at Kew, we are seeing the highest mortality rate in Quercus roba throughout our collections. Now this may correlate with that uh, it's one of the most abundantly planted trees here, but it doesn't uh, invalid, invalidate this threat. Um, what you're seeing here is you're seeing the bacterial oozing of several different bacteria that have been identified to be associated with this. The onset of this is really down to some predisposing factors such as drought, which we are experiencing unfortunately here at Kew and the South East London and across the UK. This will then sort of weaken the tree's defences and make it more susceptible for bacteria to take advantage. And once the bacteria is then taken advantage and the tree is in ill health, you have several insects, wood boring insects, which will then take advantage and lay their eggs into the tree there. I would have to say that oaks are one of my favourite groups of trees and purely because of the diversity and the variety that you see in, in the genus and the, the size, some of them can get to 60 metres, some will barely get taller than your knees. It's just sort of that diversity that makes them so unique. And I think for me, um, if I was to pick a favourite, I would just have to be true to myself and pick the Quercus roba. It's, it's always been a constant in my life. It's something I've grown up playing in, climbing, making rope swings. And it's something that um, is just such a sort of staple part of British life. It's, it's that thing in the environment, that thing in the landscape, the tree in the landscape that we've all seen before. Some of us may not notice it as much, but it just really stands out to me as just a wonderfully beautiful tree.